one of you, and I'm looking at you, and you're looking at me, and I'm doing this, and you're doing this. Now I feel right. Now I give. Now I'm. I feel threatened as a door once I knock the person out. By law, I can preemptively strike the person if I feel threatened. But by law, this is all captured on CCTV. It cannot be proved in court. So I'm going to be at a disadvantage. Therefore, it is advisable for me, or what I would say is if you're dealing with someone and you're going to hit them, before you hit them, right? I'm not saying go around hitting people either, but it's physical, physically dangerous. Uh, if you feel you're going to have to, and you, you know, what I would do is, if he's going to hit you, first of all, put your hands up. So you're showing the CCTV camera that you don't want to fight. But if you do this with golf eyeballs, and he does that with golf eyeballs, you're in trouble. It's going to go pear shaped because you're going to hit him. He's going to lose consciousness, ABH, you lost your license. ABH, or maybe, you know, what was the intention? You have to prove in court that your intention wasn't to hurt him. But on the CCTV, the picked up you've got golf eyeballs looking at the guy like that, you're in trouble. So make sure you, if I go like that, hey, whoa, whoa, because you can't, we'll do physical intervention. When you are physical, we'll be doing all this, all these gestures. So it's something that you haven't done yet. I know we've done bits and pieces with this and we've just read no. We'll do a lot more of this. So, whoa, can you hold, can you hold on there? And then the guy, the guy threatens again, whoa. And then he does it again, you go, whoa. You will be okay because you can prove there that he's gonna hit you. So be aware of the, your gestures and your non-verbal, talk about our non-verbal body language that we're giving across as well.